and welcome to my porch. You can hear that I kind of still have a morning voice a little bit. Oh well. Um, so I wanted to get on here really quick and since summer has just started and a lot of us are getting outside more and working out more or if you are inside and if you live in the southern hemisphere and you have winter upon you, uh, you still want to be active, right? So this is just some tips that I found that have really helped me stick to my home-based workouts and uh, just help me feel better all the way around. So some things that I have done include, first of all, having a vision. So I need to have a vision for what I want because if I don't, then I'm not gonna really wanna stay with my workouts very much. I have a journal where I literally list what I wanna see in my wellness. So I see, for example, and I'll write it as if it's already happened. So I'll write, I have energy that is abundant. I am able to dance for hours. I am flexible and I can do the splits. So I get specific with what I want. So that's something to think about um, as far as what you want to see in your own wellness and write that down. And then when you do your workouts, you're going to sort of think past the pain a little bit more hopefully and you're going to want to continue working out because you see that vision of yourself as if it's already happened. So there's a purpose behind what you're doing. You're not just doing it, you're not doing it as punishment by any means. You are not doing it because you need to look like somebody else. You're doing it for you. So that's what I love about vision journaling for my own wellness. Next thing, you wanna make sure that you're enjoying what you do. If you're not enjoying what you're doing, then you need to find a different workout. So I really like to do, um, I really like to do uh, workouts that are dance based because that's where I don't feel like I'm working out as much <laughs> so I can think past the pain a little bit more and then also focusing on stretching in the morning and at night don't neglect that your body needs it your body needs the alignment right uh, and focusing on core strength because no matter what you're doing you want to make sure that your back and your uh, abs are well taken care of right so definitely look into that and then take supplements that boost energy so and support the body's response to inflammation so I have supplements that I take uh, specifically for that and if you want more information about that go ahead and join our free group below our free community on Facebook and uh, you can get more information on that or you can simply message me all right, so I hope that those few tips help you because they are vital, especially the last one, right? Taking supplements that support energy and support the body's response to inflammation because when you are working out, uh, you are, you're wearing your body out, you know, um, in a good way, but uh, you want to make sure that you are giving it what it needs because the last thing you want is to do a feel, feel great workout, but then your knees are not thanking you for that, right? or your back is a little bit thrown out or something. So you wanna make sure that you are recovering well and supplements that are not full of junk and like conventional like dyes and stuff like that are going, um, you know, those aren't gonna help. So you wanna make sure that you're getting supplements that are going to help you. So those are just a few of my tips. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.